take uh, a stereo of it. Okay, Jack, that sounds great. Uh, I guess there's always a problem with getting the in-place glass, if you think that's appropriate at this point. Uh, word along those lines, though, is we'd like to have you well, go over moving in 11 minutes, so it's probably not appropriate at this time on that. Okay, there isn't any glass in this. This okay. trailer, you can feel your TV. It's just bigger. It's bigger than uh, the average trailer. And it still has that pit, the pit being about a third of the diameter of the, the inner diameter of the crater. Third of the rim, make it a fourth of the rim di diameter, that's easier. Copy that. Jack, can I look, can I look at that closely? Look at what? Hold the rake a second. We gotta be moving how many minutes, Bob? We'd like to have you move in in one zero minutes, which means uh, allow about, uh, you know, the usual three or four yeah, or five minutes to close up before that time. Okay, we'll get hustling. Okay, Bob, that, that light-colored inclusion we sample looks like a, a strange... Uh, gotcha. It's the old boulder rolling trick. I'm not getting a soil sample under there. Don't hit the rover. Get that, get that sample under there, Jack. Get yep. that rock. Okay. Got a bag? Got a bag. The soil from right underneath the rock. Down to uh, about four centimeters and 505. Experiments flight. Go ahead. We and still need one more rake sample. Is that it? Here a little too. Get the upper. We only got one. Yes, yeah, so we need a rake and a rake. Okay. A rake and a rake. Bob, this big rover. white class. I'm not sure there aren't some smaller ones than some of those other big boulders. That's just an intuitive guess. Oh, there are. But we never saw any as, as uh, obviously big as gross as this one. In fact, is this particular boulder. I photographed, I had uh, okay. three of them other than the one we sampled. And that's uh, 505 and 506 in that order. Okay, we copy that. On the so and by now, probably the best thing for you guys to do next is to come back to the rover and pick up the rake sample. Go ahead, Jack. That, uh, I get it, okay. That rock, that class, white class, I looked at it, and it has a uh, light pastel green, uh, fairly rounded crystals in a fine grain, uh, white to light, pinky tan matrix. And you can figure that one out. Looks like olivine in something. Uh, but, right there uh, on that. Sounds like a rainbow. It might be a... No, it's not those. The colors aren't that distinct, Bob. I'm just giving you shades. Okay, Roger. 